Oh, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to make a basic sketch and then turn it into an extrusion. Now, this is the first thing I do every time I start a fusion project. I'm going to click create sketch. I'm going to choose between either you could think of this as your desktop or sticking it to one of your walls. In this case I'm going to stick it to the desktop. Now under the create menu there's a list of tools you could think of as your pencils and rulers. And I'm going to create a rectangle. It wants to snap to the origin point, so I'm just going to go ahead and start there. Stretch my rectangle out. Take my hand off the mouse and enter the size 2, tab, 4, and hit enter. Now I've got a 2 by 4 cube. I am going to click finish sketch meaning I am done with that piece of paper that I pulled out and set on my desk. I want to turn it into a solid. Next I'm going to click extrude. It gives me this little arrow. If for some reason it's not selected, you're going to select a closed shape and pull it in the direction you'd like it to go. In this case I think I'll make it two inches. So now I've got a rectangular cube. Next, I'm going to make another sketch. I'm going to put that, instead of on my desk or wall, right on one of the surfaces of my object. This time, I'm going to create a circle. When you hover over the middle of a line, it gives you a little triangle that you can follow down. Hover, triangle, follow, and they snap together. I'm going to click my circle. This time, I'm going to go to dimension. I'm going to dimension this circle to one inch. And hit enter. There we go. Finish my sketch again. Click extrude. And I could either choose the outside of this box or the inside of this circle. In this case, I'd like to pull it so that it's going to cut through this object. I can either look at it from the side, or in this case, I'm going to say distance, all. So no matter how big I make that cube, it's going to have a hole through it. There we go. So, you just learned how to create a sketch, draw the shape you'd like to turn into a solid, and extrude it up into a 3D model. Thanks for watching.